this is what happens when you have your hair in a bun when you're coming back from Minnesota. I've been uh, in the air all day and I just got to the cabin. Uh, listen, I'm not gonna show myself anymore. Oh, guys, the cabin is a mess right now, but I didn't wanna go back to the office because I feel like that would have discombobulated me even more. But I'm just not having a good night. I need to go to bed. I'm only, I'm on like five hours of sleep. We're starting this vlog at night. Um, so many things are going wrong right now. So, okay, I have a sofa now. This is my old sofa. I don't know if you guys remember it from Los Angeles. But I need to clean it. But look at this. The TV got hung while I was gone. Uh, a handyman came and hung the TV. But it's like middle of the sofa. Stove. Light fixture. TV. Go that way. TV. <laughs> that's not that big of a deal like yeah it's annoying but like it's just some holes in the wall we'll patch them someone will come if not me and we'll move it over somehow and that's not that big of a deal this is a big deal you know I don't even want to show it real okay fine I'll show it the wallpaper is up the wallpaper is up and it has to come down I'm devastated the guy that installed it just did a horrible job. First of all, you're not even gonna believe this. He didn't realize that it was peel and stick wallpaper. So he like put it all up with glue and it's, it's peel and stick that's removable. So he's not only ruined the wall behind it, but he's ruined the wallpaper because as you can see, it's like bubbling up. I don't know if you can see that, but it's like puckering now because it wasn't, uh, adhered properly so it's ruined like and he did the whole wall and it's it's expensive like it's not that exp no it's it's expensive so I'm gonna have to replace all of the wallpaper we'll see if he actually um pays me I don't know I'm not paying him but he also just didn't do a very good job like matching like do you see like the deer's nose I, like I could have done better than that like, look at this seam. You can, like, see the corners of... It just it just looks really bad up close. It's it's fun, though. I like it. Um, oh, my gosh. It goes on, guys. It goes on. We're going to get to that in a minute. Um, there was a floorboard here that they messed up, and so they fixed it, but, like, it stands out. Can you see which one it is? Like, they, um... I don't know what they did, but they did this, like, distressing on the edge, which we didn't have on any of the other boards, so it already doesn't look like it fits in. And I think they did, like, a really glossy finish, whereas everything else is a matte finish. And they didn't even try to kind of, like, find a piece that looked like it fit in with the style. Molly doesn't care. When we got here, like, Molly went up to bed. She's like, I'm going to sleep. Hi. Hi. Hey, you give me love. You look good. Nothing's wrong with you. Just the things wrong with the cabin. Um, and the squirrel kept like blowing a fuse and there was a like a short in the wire. Someone clipped the wire behind the squirrel. And so they went and fixed it. But they like totally messed up. I don't know if you can see like all the paint is really bad now and like the wall is kind of like weird. So Anyway, it's just kind of frustrating that, like, I've kind of paid so much money to people, and yet they continue to sort of just do, like, kind of this, a subpar job. Um, so, Paige is like, let's talk about the cat in the room. I know, there's a cat in the room. Milk is here. Milk has been so quiet since he got here, I think he's terrified. Um, I'm trying to currently figure out if I can let him out, if this is milk toast proofed. It was a mistake to bring him tonight, for sure. And I think we're, I'm gonna have to sleep with him and Paige and Molly will sleep somewhere else. Um, we're gonna get you out in a second, Milk. If, I mean, if you wanna come out, I'm just gonna open it. Okay, Milk. I'm pretty sure I've milk toast proofed it. We're gonna open it. And if you wanna get out, you can. I'm not going to show you your living room cubby yet. We'll show you your little cubby. Is this your new home? Hey. 
It's a cool place. I promise it's going to be okay. He got really quiet when we got here. He meowed all the way up. And then when we got here, he was like, no, I'll stay in the cage. You can stay in there if you, oh, brave boy. Oh, brave boy. We got ourselves a brave boy. <laughs> what you doing there? Do you want me to show you around? I'll carry you. Come here. Mm, I got you. Let me give you the, okay, okay, ow, 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 ow. That's actually not, I don't want you up here, Milk. This is like the opposite of what I really want for cats. I know that you like to go high, but I don't want you scratching my fridge. Okay. Oh, guys, he's scared. You're just gonna explore it all, aren't you? You're gonna explore it all. Again, this is like a no-go area for you, Milk. Like, I don't want you on the stove. I don't want you, like, guaranteed he's gonna break something before the night is over. Guaranteed. Boy, do you want me to show you your cubby? Come here. This is your cubby where you're safe. Look, Milk, look, you can go in there. Yeah, go on in. <gasps> he fit through perfectly. That's where your litter box is, boy. Oh, Paige, you can't get in there. <laughs> Paige, what do you think about that? What do you think about that? Paige is like, no. I want to eat the cat. The cat can't hide. Milk. Knock, knock. Knock, knock, milk. What do you think of your cubby? There you go. This is safe space. I can't believe he went back in. He must be scared. He must be scared, boy. Oh, I'm gonna go cuddle him for a while. This is where the water is. Look at that. Look. That's where the water is. Yeah, you're gonna like it here, Milk. Eventually. No, not that one, the other one. I've never seen him scared. I'm sorry, boy. I think with cats, you're supposed to like introduce them one room at a time and make them get comfortable. Oh, he's going in this one now. We've decided to paint this room green, Milk. I hope you're okay with that, like Hunter Green. Hey, re remember this bed? This bed should seem familiar, Milk. Good morning. Good morning. Who was a good boy all night? <laughs> it's like really rainy outside. He just loved looking out the windows and cuddling up. Oh, this is so nice. Paige and Molly are like, let us in. All right, time to go hang out with everyone. Okay, it might have been uh, a whole day, and we may have just cuddled. Are you okay, boy? I feel like he is... Oh, hi, guys. The dogs just came in. We have Polly here now. Uh, hi, Polly. Um, go out. Hey, Molly, don't eat cat food. Come on, guys. Leave Milk Toast alone. Molly, Milk Toast doesn't... I mean, they were hanging out earlier. Come on. Come on, guys. I hope Milky's okay. He has like food and water and he's been like eating. Paige, no cat food for you. Let me show you, my dad came and he dropped off Polly and uh, we built my bed frame, which I think it's probably too dark to really show you now. Um, but it's it does not like a big change. It's just um, now underneath my covers, there's like a little platform. It's nice. I like it. It's just like a little step up from uh, bed being like literally on the ground. Okay, we're on a walk with Paige and Polly and we're pulling along Molly the mule. <laughs> Come on, Molly. Keep up. Keep up. Oh. Got a big hill to go up. I just got back from taking Polly and look at these girls. Look at these girls waiting for me. Hi. Hi, puppy tongs. <laughs> Aw, I have to get some um, 
I got some desk legs that are in the back of my car that my dad just brought. Because uh, I'm putting a desk up in my room. I wanted to not be able to do work here, but ow, I just hurt my elbow. Ow, my elbow. <laughs> okay, no more vlogging and opening cheap doors. <gasps> do you like it here? We're going to put books here, but I want to find some way. Hi. <laughs> Some way to get you up top. I haven't figured out how yet. But that can be your spot in here. Did you use your litter box yet? I don't think so. <sighs> Did you go to the bathroom somewhere else? It just looks a little nicer. So, it's getting there. It's getting there, Polly. <gasps> Do you want dinner? Do you guys want dinner? Okay, he wasn't scared until the dryer song just went off. And now he looks terrified. Oh my gosh, no, he was just so playful. Milk, I was just turning on the camera to show them how at home you are in the cabin. You can't be scared. Yeah, here, bite me. Bite me. Bite me. Bite me. <laughs> yeah. We've been up here three nights. I can't even believe it. And he's done so good. You've been such a good boy, haven't you? Let's get your tail over on this side so everyone can see how pretty you are. <gasps> Majestic.